Loomis is single A. And a question yeah. families ask me a lot is like, well, shouldn't we want to play at triple A or double A versus single A? And I know about the differences between, between the classes and how much I don't think it matters one bit. But you tell me how you answer that to families that might be concerned about you being a single A school versus double or triple. Yeah, I mean, I always say that you've got to look at where um, some kids from class A are going off to school. Like when you see um, there's a lot of Division One schools that that are getting kids from from class A. And that speaks to the strength of the, of the league. Um, like it, it is, it is tough. Like again, a school like Milton has been awesome, and and they started <laughs> what Boston College, Purdue, Harvard, and Princeton. Their starting lineup. Like I'm pretty sure that there were some double A's and triple A's that did not have that. Um, I want to say it was a good amount of them. So I, I think it's for for folks. It's tough for them to. If, if they're unfamiliar with it, to kind of get a grasp of what, what is with the different classifications and is it better to be AAA, better to be AA than A? Is it better to be A than B? I mean, there's some B schools that are, ter- that are terrific. There's So I think it's a lot of beauty in the eye of the beholder, but um, I always talk to families about where kids have gone from Loomis and where kids have gone from the rest of the league. Um, and you've got guys in, in the NBA who played at, in Class A. so. Um, on any given night, you can have an awesome Class A school. You know, it'll be a dogfight for a Triple A school. So. 